Vex here, and today we're doing the Skyrim duplication glitch. Right now, if you know like people you want to duplicate, like Skyrim, it's not the easiest stuff to like get. Like I'm quite far in, but like if say you want like a bunch of arrows, it's gonna be a really tedious method to get arrows. But say you want to like duplicate your favorite bow or your favorite sword, like say I want to duplicate Harkin's sword. There's only one of them, so you want to do a wielder, you can do that. Like, it's easy to duplicate one or two things. Right, now in order to do this glitch, you'll need to have the item that you want and a follower. Now, easy followers to get is, like, L Lydia, Feindal, and some crazy lady at the bar over there. You can give her 100 gold, um, like, bet 100 gold on a, uh, like, fist fight sort of stuff, like, bare hands. And, like, so... If you beat her, she'll become your follower and you get 200 gold, your gold, and then her gold. And then you can do it. But I've got Lydia, because I've fought the dragon and stuff. And I've got Feindal, who's waiting back in Riverwood. Right, so, you need to unlock White Run and like, beat her. So, when you have your follower and the item you want, so I'll try and duplicate the Ebony Blade and some ingredients for alchemy. Now, when you walk in, turn to your right, head over to this little like corner thing. Go into your inventory. Uh, so I'm going to try with Harkin's sword and some ingredient, like a potion, for example. I'll try and do these. So you want to drop them on the floor. So these are the three items I want to duplicate. So in order to do this, you need to ask your follower, like, I need you to do something. She doesn't seem very happy about it. So you want to ask them to take the item. Just... Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, so this might be annoying. So, once you've asked them to pick it up, you can open into Skyrim. You don't want to walk back in through the gate, you want to fast travel back in. And once you get back in, you'll need to. Uh, yeah, once you get back in, you need to um, check if your item's there. If it's not, the glitch hasn't worked properly. But what normally happens is once you travel back in, if it's if you've got more than one item there, one of the items will disappear, not duplicate, but it'll be in your followers' inventory. So say you want to duplicate two elven swords, like you've got two elven swords, one's enchanted, one's not. You want to drop both the elven swords, even though you only want the enchanted one. Because one will disappear during the duplication. So I come back over here. See, one of the potions of blood have disappeared. And one stayed. So, with Hark and Sword, now I have two. So, you may think, hold on. You dropped it, and now you've only got one. But, like, I now got th two potions of blood, which is how I started with. <coughs> so I've got one Hark and Sword. Now, if I go over to Lydia and ask her to trade, she will have what I've dropped. So, I've been duplicating Grand Soldiers and Black Soldiers because I really want to get my stuff up. But, see, look, Hark and Sword. I just picked one up, and two potions of blood, which, oh, okay, yeah, so that leaves me with two swords on the, see, ah, I didn't realise this, but apparently it refills your enchantment, because that's the one I originally had, and that's the one I just duplicated, now if you go to potions, like, I had two to start with, now I have four, I don't know how I got four, because normally one disappears and it doesn't appear again, you just get it from your inventory, <coughs> so, I've been trying this really, like, a lot to try and get more Jag Prowns, because I want to give them to all my followers. So I'll try it one more time. So go to Apparel. So Jag Crown. And I'll use these to try and make it not disappear. So oh use... God, now I shall... Oh, no, not wait. Uh, take them and take that. Now you want to leave White Run through the gate. Remember, don't fast travel out of the gate, go out of the gate. And then, once you're out, fast travel back in, and the item you want to duplicate should be there. But say you have like a stack of 30, because I have a bunch of potions of invisibility. So I want to duplicate them so I can sell them and make money. You've got to drop them individually, which is why it's tedious to get arrows. Because if you drop, like, a, say, a pile of 1,000, and you duplicate, you won't get another 1,000 in return, you get one arrow. You're going to get one of that specific thing. That's why if you drop a bunch of potions, like 10 potions, you'll get 9 duplicated most of the time. 
sometimes 10, because that the first time it's ever happened, you've got all of your items duplicated. Okay, turn back. And... Ah! Two disappeared. That's odd. Right, so... Okay, she's wearing it, that's what... That's something, if they wear or equip the sword or shield, whatever you give them, it will not duplicate. Did not realise she put it on. So, I should have the boots in here. So you five boots, so the boots are duplicated. And I want my crown back. But the boots are still there, so it proves it does work, but it's a little sketchy. So sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't work. Like, it's weird for this, but... Anyway. Thank you for watching guys, let me know if you like this video.